Okay, so you've been living under a rock if you haven't seen the new trend on TikTok. Yes, I said TikTok. I'm in love with TikTok. It's my favorite. Um, <laughs> Instagram has gone down the drain for me, even for my business. Um, so right now, everybody's doing their vision boards for 2023, which is great. Um, but this one girl made a video, which I'll link in the description, about turning it into a bingo card so it's a game and you know you got your free spot in the middle and you're just trying to get as many bingos as possible so i made a bingo card for my newsletter which already went out and now i'm making another one um but at the bottom you have some rewards that you can give yourself for getting a bingo the whole goal is to get as many bingos as possible and uh i have one listed for the personal and then one listed for your business goals uh, assuming you know how to be a business. But then I saw a fellow artist, um, Puzzle Arts, and she did one that was a three by three because she was like, I really can't handle the five by five, which is understandable because that's a lot of goals to stick on there. But, so um, I was like, I'm gonna make another one because I like yours. And I did the three by three like a tic-tac-toe and we still got the rewards and then in January. And so I did the whole year and I'm gonna send this out to my newsletter tomorrow, right? So Monday the 9th. So it's the whole year that I did and it's for both for your personal and your business goals. Um, I'm thinking I might add in quarterly goals because somebody might wanna just do quarterly. Uh, but this is just gonna be a freebie that I'm gonna send out to my newsletter. So if you aren't on the newsletter, join the newsletter because I'll be sending it out all week. Okay. So I went to Ikea last week and to get some more organizational things to add to my pegboard. So we need to move all of this around. I got some more of these um, containers as well as this to hold some papers and some more hooks. So let's get started. So this pegboard is held up together by four command strips at each corner. So I don't know if it's gonna be able to handle all the extra stuff I wanna add to it. Um, Okay, I got it in. I wanted to hold my papers that I'm constantly going for. These are stickies. I need to get some file folders. I'm sure I have some somewhere. But yeah. Okay. Let me finish this. what I have gotten done. Um, added in the little file folder. That's where I keep a lot of the stickers that I use that go on the packaging. It'll be a lot easier than pulling it out of here every time. And then I got some more of these and I got to print more labels on my thermal printer. Um, that's normally where I keep my freebie stickers. Probably gonna fill this up some more with stickers from different companies. 
or artist. <clears throat> um, but yeah, it looks very basic. I just added in a couple of new things to help me be a little more organized when I'm packing orders right here. And for the life of me, I couldn't get these cute little knobs on. They're kind of like these, except they go in there. It, I don't know, I don't know. And at Home Goods, I found this storage container. So if you don't have a container store where you live, definitely check out your Home Goods. This is what it is. That's the size. Does it show up? Of the drawers. So they're three inches wide and basically almost seven inches long and about two inches tall. And this is where I'm going to start keeping my die cut stickers because right now I just keep them in here in a bunch of baggies. I want to get more into die cut stickers. So figure probably need one of these. Um, I don't know if this is cheaper at the container store because this thing costs $40, $39.99. Um, but it's the same concept. This is where I've been keeping them in an online labels um, thing and some, whatchamacallit. But I really wanna get into die cut. Look, I really wanna get into die cut stickers and um, just figured I should start storing them a little bit better. Um, and it comes with these dividers which I don't think I'll need because my stickers are usually three inches, which is gonna take up the majority of the space. Ah, come on, oh, I guess it's meant to stick. Right. There we go, okay, look at me. I got these naturally dope stickers. Let me try a divider. Oh, they have two different slots where you can put the divide, so. That's good. So then you could have like three different things in here. Yeah, so my stickers are definitely not meant for that. Maybe I can use it for those ones. I wish I knew. redesign this one. I am. I'm gonna redesign it. Honestly, I think I'm gonna turn this into a notebook to put on my Amazon. And that would be unisex for like men and women. But these are, um, these are freebies because I messed up and left the white piece in the O and it's not supposed to be there. Oh no. Can these not fit in there?
and stuff. These are my latest design featuring Diva Doll Soleil. She also has her own um, notebook, which you can get on Amazon. This notebook, you can get it on Amazon. It is a journal. It has password tracker in the back. And in the beginning of the book, it has a brain dump and monthly goals along with a mood tracker and a habit tracker. Isn't that nice? Look how nice those curls printed. Beautiful. All right, so thank you guys for joining me today. Um, I gotta check all of this inventory and get it ready for Friday the 13th when it's going to drop. Um, but yeah, see you in the next vlog.